Hey guys and welcome back to another how to tutorial and today I'm going to show you how you can make this really awesome speedboat. So guys stay tuned and I'm going to show you how you can make it. Right guys to make this really awesome speedboat we are going to need all the blocks that you can see right in front of me. We are going to need quartz blocks, dark oak stairs, dark oak slabs, quartz stairs, grey stained glass, grey stained glass panes, white carpet, snow layers and buttons. Now once we have all of these blocks guys we then need to find an area of where we want to build our speedboat. Now I have a little lake set up right here and this is a perfect place to build it. So the first thing we want to do is grab our quartz blocks and place them down where we want the front of our boat to be. So I want my front of my boat to be in this area. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place down two blocks like that until I get a block that is level with the water just like this now this is going to be the start of the base of our boat so what we're going to do here we're going to build out another block so we have two blocks like that then on the end of this block we're going to do one on either side just like that so we have a three wide so two at the front and then three wide then we're going to bring this down by two more blocks so we're going to do one two like that and we're going to do it all the way across like this so we're gradually making this shape so now what we're going to do on the next layer we're going to build three more like this and and then we're going to put one on either side so it makes a total of five so we're slowly going out like this now from this block here we're going to build nine more down in this direction so it's a total of ten so this block here is number one so then we're going to do one uh, two three four five six seven eight nine ten let me do that again on the other side so this is number one so then it's two three four five six seven eight nine ten now this is how long our boat is going to be so what we can do now is join the back together like this now at the back what we're going to do is place a block there and a block there and this is going to be our final detail for the shape of our speedboat so what we're going to do now we're going to start filling up the inside part of this boat right here so I'm going to build another layer of quartz blocks all the way across but on this part right here I'm going to get myself some dark oak slabs and I'm going to put double dark oak slabs across like that then I'm going to put slabs at the bottom half of that block like this and then what I'm going to do is get my quartz blocks place one quartz block there one quartz block there and get a dark oak stair and place it in the middle like this the reason we're doing this is this is going to be the driver's quarters so we're just marking it out now then what we're going to do is fill the rest of this area up here with quartz blocks just like that and then once we've done that guys this is going to be the base of our speedboat so what we're going to do now is start building up the rest of it now to do that we're going to start from the front once again and we're just going to put two quartz blocks like that and we're going to do it all the way around the edges so I'm going to put three there and then I'm going to put three here and I'm going to go around the other side and do the same so put three here and then three here like this and then what we're going to do is go to the back of the boat then we're going to put a stair right here on this side and then we're going to put a stair on this side right here then we're going to get our quartz blocks once again and we're going to place down four so one two three four like that and we're going to do the same on this side one two three four then we're going to get our quartz stairs and we're going to place an upside down stair right there and then another one right in front of it so it just makes this nice little shape right there and we're going to do the same on this side as well so one there and one there now this bit is totally up to you you see this back part of the boat what you can do is get yourself some quartz slabs and you can place it on there as well you don't have to do this part but I thought I'd show you it because you can place it like that if you want to make it look like it's gradually going down so as you can see we have the frame to our boat now so what we're going to do now we're going to start adding some extra details so I'm going to get my snow layers and from this block right here we're going to place one snow layer then on the next block we're going to place two snow layers and then we're going to put two right next to it right here we're going to do the same on the other side so one and then two and then two like that then what we're going to do is get our gray stained glass panes place one here and one here then we're going to get our sta uh, stained glass blocks place one there and one there and then we're going to join it up in the middle because this is where the driver is going to sit so to do that we're going to get our slabs once again and oh, no, we're going to get our stairs sorry and we're going to place upside down stairs going across like that then we're going to put our glass on top of the stairs like this so this is like the windshield for our speedboat then we're going to get ourselves some white carpet and place it on top of the glass like that now we're going to add some snow layers to the front 
of the boat as well but this time what we're going to do we're going to get uh, th we're going to put three snow layers down so we're going to do one two three like that and we're going to do that all the way across so there's going to be three snow layers all the way across this front part like this just to give it that extra little bit of detail so do that until you get to the other side and you stop at this glass block right here so as you can see guys the boat is really starting to take shape now and starting to look like a speedboat so what we're going to do now is start filling up the deck of the boat now with the deck what we're going to do is grab ourselves some dark oak slabs and we're going to put a dark oak slab in the space right here so we're just going to fill up this area right here until we get to the rest of the dark oak slabs here then what we're going to do we're going to stop right here and we're going to place a quartz stair here and here so it looks like the seats where the drivers would sit and as you can see we filled up that area so that looks nice now now at the front what we're going to do is we're going to put a slab on the upper half of the block right here so just underneath the glass right there so it looks like the deck is slightly raised and we're just going to fill up this area right here so we have a little bit of a higher deck at the front and then we have this deck at the back where you can go and sit down and uh, drive the boat as well so finally guys we're going to add some final touches to the boat we're going to grab ourselves some buttons and we're going to put two buttons uh, at the front right here and two buttons on the other side just to add that little bit of detail right there so there we go guys there is the boat complete now you can leave the boat like this if you want to but you can also add one final touch to the boat again it's totally up to you what you can do is grab yourself a piston and then on this block right here what we can do is place an upside down piston like that then we can put a lever on top of this piston and this looks like the engine for the speedboat like the motor and then this is where someone would sit and pull this and kind of steer the boat kind of thing like that you can totally do that if you want to it's totally up to you but you don't have to do it but other than that guys we have a really simple and cool looking speedboat that you can put in any of your minecraft worlds but guys if you enjoyed this tutorial today and you want to see more just like this and you never want to miss an upload from me all you need to do is click on the little bell symbol next to the subscribe button and you will be notified every time i upload a brand new tutorial but thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed it and i will see you again in another how to tutorial